Welcome back to Factorio C Block and TSM episode number 167. Um, okay, there's a few things that we can do. First of all, uh, we needed steel for modules. Was it modules or was it over here? Um, we've already supplied it over here. It was over here, but we've already supplied it over here. And we have a vast amount of these resources now. So that is fantastic. Um, my hatchery is not getting fed uh, quite as much as it perhaps should. Um, how come you're not... Oh, you don't... Why do you care what's going on over there? You don't. You've got all this food. You should just unload it. Hmm. This one. Um, the one that puts food in here... Uh, that's the one that should care. This one should just unload, I think. So I've, it looks like I need to redo that a little. Uh, we need to make a gold um, city block, probably this one. In fact, let's commit to that, say. Um, gold, that's aluminium. Um, gilded, well, gilded copper wire will be there, but it's actually that one. Um, gold because we're going to need gold. Um, so we either advance, well, we need it for modules for one thing. We either advance modules, actually build the level zero modules so I can get the next armor, or we build our make everything factory. Now, the thing with the make everything factory is I actually want the make everything part in a block like this and um, the two, so this is like the opposite. The, I, I want the access for trains to whiz around to be sort of the top the top and below the actual where the make everything is, right? Because um, it's just going to work out a lot better if that is the case. I... I could revise the plan and put the make everything here. Just seems, I mean, it just seems like it's a long way away from some of these other things. Uh, but this is actually in the format that I'm after. Um, sorry, this bit here is in the format that I'm after. Although I am thinking that I probably need more of this mineral sludge very soon. But, um, I mean, we could build it. We can build another. There's nothing stopping us building another layer here or building some up the top for example so maybe having carefully done this and saying I was going to do it here maybe I've convinced myself that I'm going to change my mind and do it here instead uh, in which case what I might do is um, pop the titanium chests uh, let's see do I want any of this for the moment maybe not uh, although actually that's not entirely true I probably still want my uh, gun I still want my gun in which case I want those guys and those guys the rest of that doesn't really matter nor does the rest of that really matter um, what I want is probably to empty That lot, um, in fact, we were able to take the whole chest. And we will fill in these um, city blocks and start work on our new make everything. Uh, even though I don't have the bots that I want to handle it yet. But it's not going to be a single episode to get it done. It's going to take longer than that. I probably should have jumped on a train, um, to be honest. Uh, I might just confirm that all of the uh, signals make sense before we get too far into this, because I'm aware that we have perhaps looked at these 
things before. So this one is this one is a going up, which does make sense because this one is a going down. So that's great. This one is a east, which means that this one should be a west. That is a west. This is an east. Um, this one should be a west. This one should be an east. It, they all are. This is a down. This is up. Up, 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 up. Okay, I'm happy with that. That does make sense. Good. Um, right. This is not the block in the middle, but this is an important block. Let's get a nice large brush. Um, we may need liquid. I'm not sure about that yet. Um, I may as well realise that I could be making explosives. I don't necessarily need to do it this way, but... Uh, it's, I'm just sort of used to this now. It's my thing. <laughs> so, there we go. Um, fortunately this doesn't take that long in size. Look at this horrid green water. We don't want green water, we want uh, blue water. So if we can expand faster than the pollution, we will have nice tropical looking water rather than um, kind of heavy city harbour. Um, lots of shipping gross water. Um, I think I've got ex oh yeah I do have my explosives on me so this is definitely something I want rid of in fact this is the block that is the uh, this is the one where I want everything to be built I'm not sure if it is possible I will want a source of water for some things um, not sure what so having water down the sides may prove to be a uh, unnecessary luxury I guess but um, it is what it is so yes as I think I sort of alluded to my plan is that this middle segment actually is the, the the make everything proper, which will just be bots buzzing backwards and forwards through um, logistics um, bots um, and robo ports, because uh, that gives you the tightest pack, um, and the. Uh, make everything from a point of view of say the outpost builder or even anybody else is really just going to be um, um, oh, here we go again I wonder what the chances of that was bad don't be greedy I think is the uh, suggestion after that rather dismal effort um, so yes, basically, you won't even need to, I mean, getting around the, we do have squeak through, so it won't be as as bad as I'm kind of suggesting, but getting around the uh, area where we have just heavy, heavily compacted uh, build zones for buildings and all the intermediate products you need for building those buildings, um, not a shouldn't be necessary except for the build phase and B um, oh, we have more of this stuff uh, hmm. 
What's that? Desert Garden. Nice. Um, we've just expanded to encompass that. No special planning on our part required. Um, yeah, so basically these are just, well, it'll make more sense going from the top. And I'm going to build or try and build the items that we don't currently have in um, the sort of bus base, main base, if you like, but it's basically a bus base. Um, I'm going to build those items we don't have already so that I can use the multi-ME facility. Um, let me just go ME. I don't know what symbol should go in there, but ME for make everything. Um, and this can be like the ME in, uh, little n and the ME out. If that makes any sense. So raw resources come into the ME in, which is this segment. And um, then they get consumed in the ME and provided to the ME out. That's basically the strategy. And what I want is uh, probably all of my stuff back right now. Probably all my stuff back. I can return this small amount of landfill. So at least it's quite a good way of using up some of the landfill. Although we now have a fairly good way of getting rid of crushed stone at least. Um, we still have some landfill collections outside of that. Um, like this place here, for example. So, basically, I think I want to unload the sorts of resources we need into four um, warehouse sized uh, passive providers. Um, I am over too much, it's just up here. So you've rebuilt hardly anything in all that time, so have all of that. Um, and our stuff is where is it actually <laughs> now that you ask where actually did i put our stuff i thought i put it up there am i gonna have to freeze this recording so that no so that i can find where i left my stuff hilarious in a uh, convoluted kind of odd way um, you lot go in there you can come out uh, how about I find the stuff and uh, just turn it up to max and then Transfer all of those things, then give them back to this box down here. Uh, then get our stuff back. Um, and then... Um, maybe get a couple of thousand of that set this back to where we really want it which is probably those numbers 
Uh, and we're back in action. Um, I'm thinking I might want some of these. I think I may have hit that just a second too late. I don't want monosilicon, thanks buddy. Well, we can't just dump it now, we have to... We have to take it all the way up ourselves. Yeah, there you go. Monosilicon, what else can I get rid of? Gold. Uh, limestone. There's a lot of things in there. Okay. Um, so, if we want for warehouses that are basically passive provider warehouses, um, I am going to need some more red circuits. Go away, thank you. I don't need your crap. I don't need belts at the moment. Um, I do need red circuits. Go away, I don't want your crap. Um, one, two, three, four. Possibly I should have gotten some logistic bots while I was out. Um, right, we're at the wrong end, so let's head up a bit. I think I already have some puffer eggs, so maybe cutting this down doesn't really make a difference. No. Gets it out of the way. So, um... If we were up here and we got our uh, passive providers, something like this, uh, how much space have I left there? I don't think there's enough for Express stack inserters is there? No. Okay. So I actually need to move these guys down. Like so. And I want to copy them. Um, this is just because I'm expecting there to be a huge number of resources um, going into this place. So we're going to need a lot of inserters. Do I care which uh, thing these items go into? I don't think I do. Uh, to be perfectly blunt, um, I just want them to be able to unload. So that's where all of the incoming resources will go. Now, as I think I've alluded to, I'm going to use direct circuit um, connections here. So what I would like to do is probably... Uh, I don't know what. Um, I want to... I want to have traffic come in and have the ability to actually go into a stacker. For the first time in this factory. 
Uh, okay, we should move you down a little bit then. Uh, to there, maybe. So that we can do that. Oh, now you're a problem. Okay, that's fine. Um, I guess it's not the only thing that you could call a stacker. But um, the idea for me... is that if we can have two or three or even more trains lined up here that's kind of a good thing i've actually allowed far too much room haven't i i don't like how they've given me a well everybody <laughs> Everybody, as it were, a um, limit on how far you can reach with your rail. It was good before. This rail is sufficiently annoying to lay down sometimes. So, um, the idea basically is just that um, trains can occupy in here. I don't know how big it is, how, whether we can actually get two trains in there or not. Um, I can worry about whether that's a relevant consideration at a future date. For now, um, for now, I want a very tiny, uh, a very tiny bit of rail there, or island rather, so that we can, I'm doing this all wrong, you should be one of those, and should have another one of those, that's better. Then, um, this will be a requester station, of course, um, like so. Uh, why? I've got these on the wrong way, haven't I? That's going down. So all of this is completely around the wrong way. Oh, that doesn't help. I could have it come across like this. It doesn't come across far enough if it does that, but... And that's all... Um, bad, but yeah, we could do that. quite what I had in mind, but I didn't plan this properly, so you get what you pay for. move you down to there and uh, there and once again we've got one of these guys in the wrong place but that's easily remedied uh, okay Those. Uh, that's all around the wrong way. And 
these uh, around the wrong way, but that's okay. Now. So how we had our stacker originally was kind of May have looked better, perhaps, but um, this will suffice. Uh, unless I want to redirect everything this way round, and then you go out this way. Uh, which actually is not a bad idea. Just means that this whole construction is fairly crappy if it's going out here. And then when do you, where do you... Where do you rejoin? No, this is this is dumb. Um, I preferred the way I was trying to do it originally. Uh, okay, let's just get rid of um, Okay, let's go cut. I'm sure this bit will be useful somewhere. And cut. Nowhere to put the blueprint, huh? Um. So. What we want is this is just not going to work. <sighs> okay, never mind. Uh, let me just do it this way. Probably sufficient although I want to bring it down uh, maybe a bit more that also doesn't work these may as well get thrown away because they're completely useless um, get up there no don't go round and round in a circle dude oh come on <laughs> Right, so, um, yeah, the trains can do their stop there and then take off. Like so. Um, so, do I have a request to stop? Yes, I do. Uh, interesting. That would imply I need to move um, these guys. Forward one. And these guys also forward uh, actually, it implied nothing of the sort. What it implied was I need to just change the orientation of the inserters. They were fine. So, um, 
Oh, no, that doesn't work, does it? It needs to pick up from here, which means it does want to put there. So I am actually wrong. I do want to... Um, I do want to move it over. And these as well. Move them over one. And then we'll move the slot over like so and the slot over like so and then you can orient uh like so um and obviously the one at the end here is not going to work so yeah this one needs to go the other way this one and that one yeah the rest should work so um, there is our basic design and for the third or fourth or Whatever we're up to time, I will try and signal this again. Um, and down here. Um, and we'll need one of these as well, I think. Um, and as soon as you get past the station, you will want to go past the signal so the next train can come in. Uh, and over here, you need to change to one of those, one of those, and have one of these as soon as you get past this point. Okay, so, um, I mean, really, that's about the extent of this place. Unless I have uh, some special processing, which I may well have some special processing up here, but otherwise this is more or less what we're talking about. Um, with probably... Uh, it's not so good, is it? Yeah, I guess it is. Uh, something like that. Now, I probably should make the... Um, so we need to cover this entire area in logistics, which would be uh, something like this. One would have to be there. And we probably want some of these things handy. Um, but I think I probably want like four of those stations. So maybe the next step is to actually build um, three more. I'm not sure what it is that we're missing. Tinned copper wire, brass. Maybe. Um, what does it say we can build one and then it pretends that we can't? I don't know. Let me come over here. The thing with Make Everythings is that they need a lot of different resources, but they don't tend to burn through them that fast. Uh, maybe it will seem that they do initially, but 
I guess we're going to be doing a lot of building fast, especially once we have uh, pretty much everything that we require built. It's just design um, of the processes. And where they're similar, they're going to come up very fast. Like the gold, for example. Um, I'd like to think that's more the norm rather than the exception. We can get things built that quickly. I'll be happy. I'll be a happy man. I've come over too far, haven't I? What am I looking for? Um, I am looking for... Let's start with some red circuits. Um, there's a steady stream of them, but I wouldn't exactly call it healthy. Healthy stream. Okay, that is not my problem. No, I don't want you. I'm going to turn off. Uh, all these belts. Um, in fact, I'm going to turn off that. They can pick up this stuff, that's fine. Um, but I don't want them delivering a whole lot of belts because we're not using belt at the moment. Uh, okay, crafting. So. We can build a RoboPort 1. Um, and then it says we're missing the ability to build this, so we need brass. Okay. I know one of these is brass, but it's always easier if you go to the source. Oh, and circuits are definitely something we're going to have to build pretty early on. Um, okay, so I think you're bronze. No, you're brass. Okay, um, we need a robo hatch door too. Um, robo port charging pad two, we need four. One, two, and then we're missing invar plate, which I think is this one. Invar plate and Oh, unfortunately, the Invar is only just being manufactured at the same rate it's being consumed, or it actually wants to be consumed even faster. Um, can we build one yet? Yes, we can. Uh, now, the other thing that I would like to build is one of these, which needs one of these um, and then nine RoboPort charging pad twos. Uh, one, two and then we're short on batteries. Which are just here. to seven and then we're short on red circuits knew we needed a lot of red circuits um, these are the charging pads eight nine uh, we can now build one of those um, and I expect that this is not quite enough coverage and that we're going to expand this in the future, but the future is the future. We can live with what we have for now. Oh yes, this train. I don't think it's doing anything useful. Sure I've said that before. Okay, so um, we probably want you more or less say there. Um, you can have a power thingy here and another charging pad thingy here. And I am going to get rid of this water.
because I want to get on with actually building something useful today in this very place. Um, I think oh, I can build lots of these easily. These ones take a bit more effort. So I'm just going to use simple um, assembly machine twos. And then when this this place has the ability to build assembly machines, um, I'll upgrade them to fours, fives even, or sixes for the ones that really need it. And the other thing we're going to need a few of is these. And that means we need a whole bunch of steel. I think they just stole a whole lot of steel off me, or I've used it for building these things. Um, I could start setting up some of the stuff that we want delivered here. Um, which will be not a ghost reader, but a standard um, combinator, constant combinator, and a, I think it's an arithmetic combinator actually that I want. So, We're going to need to hook all of these up. And you are going to be, for example, uh, maybe 4,000 is the unit size that I'm going to want here. Um, no, I've got something I don't want. Um, signal. I want uh, iron plate. Minus 4,000. And I want steel plate. Um, minus 4,000. And just like at modules, this is basically going to be uh, we're going to sum what's in here. We're going to sum it with these negative numbers and we are going to Um, divide actually uh, we may this may not work quite the way I want it to um, maybe they should be 8,000 and we divide by 4,000. Input will be each divided by say 4,000. Output each. Uh, right, that is exactly what I wanted to have happen, but I suspect these values might need to be higher so we've got two trains coming. Um, this is instead of me running to get uh, steel. That's how all this started. I really want this to be when you've got 4,000 left. I think I might have my arithmetic slightly incorrect. But um, come and deliver this. And then now emptying one of these should take almost no time see those thousands ticking down really fast this is the steel so I'm going to grab 200 steel uh, so that I can um, do oh make chests that's right make chests 
So I want five of those and five of those. There you go. Positive numbers. 11k equals two. I'm hoping that minus 100 equals minus one, but I suspect it might not. Anyway, we'll soon see. Um, so the idea is we need to look at the intermediates, um, which are these sorts of things, these sorts of things. Um, what have we got here? Uh, these are more, we, we will do all of these. Um, as for these, we'll certainly do, I might, uh, I'm not going to do wooden chests. Uh, it'll be make virtually everything that you might need. I'll do all of these because they're requirements in the next higher tier. Um, I will do all of these, especially these since we need these. And I'll do all of these. So there's a couple of things that I want to do. Um, I want to... Um, okay, so pipes. Because they're used in machines, we need most of these different sorts of pipes. Um, belts. Um, I am still likely to use belts. Does this mean I haven't actually unlocked these yet? I may not have. 60 items, 75 items per second. Yeah, um, I may want to do those. Um, so where are the iron gear recipe and so on? Oh, they're here, okay. So I need iron gears, I need sticks. Um, these might be specials. Yeah, they're probably going to be specials because they're involved in launching the spaceship and some of these things are specials as well. Modules are its own thing, although the beacons probably need to be done here. What's the difference between the beacon and the beacon 2? Um, beacon, you get a like a 50% penalty. Beacon 2, it doesn't actually say, but it uses twice the power. That's awkward, isn't it? Might have to check and config. Anyway, we'll probably do beacons. But um, to do, say, the assembly machines and the electronics machines, um, you need... Oh, you need circuit board. Yes, and then you need green circuit, then you need red circuit red circuit again and then processing unit and then the advanced processing unit for the really good ones um, okay but in terms of intermediates um, we're not going to do these why would we do these they don't make sense um, iron gear wheels iron gear wheels uh, steel gear wheel brass gear wheel and steel bearing uh, then you're into the titanium gear wheel and bearing and then you're into the nissanol gear wheel and bearing so we need to do all the gear wheels and all the bearings um, probably sort of here and here um, so I might kind of start here um, and I need a way of powering all of this as well. Um, I guess I want to do it as much as possible with these guys. I already... I oh know, that's just a normal substation. One. So, yeah, I probably want the next level of substation. Because this is too small, but the next level probably takes processing units and rubber insulated wire. So, uh, one, two, oh, this is, if this is going to be gear wheels. So, let's start off with 
gear wheel and then um, the rest of the gear wheels are all here. It would be nice if they actually moved everything to being here. What's this guy? No idea. Um, I wonder if any of these can't be built by these machines. Um, the steel, the brass, the cobalt steel, the titanium. We need more of these machines. Can't build them. Um, then we need... Uh, does that make sense to do that? No, but what I might do... Uh, whoops. What I might do is place one shared requester every two and a shared provider every two. No, oh, excuse me. Um, <clears throat> because we can, we don't have a lot of space. Um, would it work if it was here? Not as easily. Because we're going to need inserters here, here. That covers those two, so this one actually doesn't need to be here. Um, you should be looking at that. You should be looking at that. Incorrect. Uh, no, incorrect. That. So that's what we need for... Requesting. So it can go like that. Uh, and if that's the case, actually I could. Um, of course, we're slightly close here. Although, you're unusual. So maybe you get an unusual location for those. Everybody else, though... could have something like that and that. So in this way, we only use one row between the machines. I do kind of like that. Um, what do I need to actually make these machines? Oh, we need electronic circuit, and we need the ability to... Oh, and, and basic circuit. So you know... You know where this is going, don't you? We are going to need to start building those circuits um, pronto. So that uh, I can bring them down here and have the space start building itself. So I think that's probably a good point to go, okay, we're starting to shape up here. Um, and it might not look like much yet, but give it some time. Um, I'm, start, I'm liking how I'm able to squish all this in. Uh, so yeah. Until next time, guys, thanks for joining me, and I look forward to seeing you then. Bye-bye for now.